Oyomuwala 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 Yeah Give it up for Bruno K One time, one time, one time Let's settle in, let's settle in Bruno K, it's good to have you On the show Vocals always on point, yo You never disappoint at that Thanks, bro It's good to have you here uh, it's always good ha being here. This is like home, yeah, you yeah, know. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Calvin is my brother. Yeah, and this is like home. Uh, this is like UBC home. UBC Magic One Star TV. Yeah, man. yeah. This yeah. is like home. Back then, uh, the guitar used to be uh, your handbag or better half. Mm -hmm. You to lack of a better so one. Yeah, you know. Sometimes um, that the interviews don't have to be the same. That yeah. every time Bruno K comes on set, he needs to play the guitar. You need to change a little bit. Yeah. yeah. So it doesn't have to be all the time that you need to play the guitar. Yeah. Sometimes you need to change. Much because, you know, more songs. Because I remember when Irene Ntare was starting out, she would always move with her guitar by her side. Uh, Maurice Curry, I would always move with the guitar. You, you will always move the guitar. I think, have you dropped that trend? All you guys. I didn't drop it. Now I carry the guitar when Calvin tells me, come with the guitar. I think then I, I wanted to show people that, you know, we don't just sing in studio mm. that I can perform that I'm a live performer with my guitar yeah yeah but I, I, I always move with my guitar but just then I wanted to show it because my management used to tell me you know what yeah you need to go do something you know because people be thinking that we just sing these songs in studio but we can't sing them live yeah yeah, yeah. so, yeah. so I, I used to come do that so that the fans know and then they know oh this is a yeah. Uh, guitarist and also a vocalist, yes. I don't know how I forgot, you know, production. There is a picture that I'd wanted us to show of Bruno K six years ago with his guitar, <laughs> but then he wasn't yet mugged. <laughs> <laughs> you know, the Bruno Kill then that yeah. I interviewed six years back yeah. and Bruno Kill now. Very, You're looking great, those, bro. I saw you know? those big man. Thank you. I think on set I had you and Irene Intari on that day. And Ray's signature, I think. Yeah, and Ray's signature. About seven Ray? years ago. Yes, yeah. yes, yes. And it's been long, man. It's been long. I was younger then. I was smaller. And yeah, man. I was just learning some yeah, things in the but industry. But the beard has not, you know. Uh, it will yeah. come, bro. It's <laughs> must struggle. Yeah, it will yeah. come. Yeah. But I know in these six years, some of the people that you started out with, some of course, uh, are still pushing through. Some have fallen off due to many reasons. Uh, for the guys, they will tell you, "Yes, I want to be a star." The money comes in. The ladies come in. Drugs come into play, uh, among other things. You know. How have you been able to protect yourself? First and foremost, I'm not someone who has a lot of money, like you'd say. I have what is enough for me, you know. I'm yeah. not that guy you'd say, hey, Bruno, get more gag new. <laughs> but in future, maybe. Yeah. No, in the, some cases, the ladies reinvest. <laughs> uh, ladies do invest. Oh, yeah. What are you talking about? Oh, it, yeah. It, it comes with, uh, what do I call it, strings attached, you yeah. know. Yeah, it comes with strings attached. Such things. Why don't you have friends who are being bankrolled by ladies? I know I have, but still I have a kufuga. Yeah. Yeah, I have those friends. Okay, let's turn this microphone. Let me hope. Let me hold just a little bit. Okay. Yeah. Microphone is on. Yeah. Hope they can be able to hear you. So, Baba Bebe Baba Kufuga, you know, such I've been with such kinds of friends. There's a lot of disrespect yeah. when, when, when it's the woman financing and, you know, disrespect what. But... Um, when it comes to me, I mean, I'm a hustler, you know that, Calvin. When I'm a million, I'm a I'm a I'm a I'm a video, I'm a So I've always planned with my management, especially my brothers like mm. Ivan, Ken, uh, those guys helped me out. Uh, they help me out. We plan. Even now, now that even Black Market is on board, mm. they help me out with some things. Yeah, and I have other friends who believe in my, my career. Some yeah. don't want to be mentioned here, mm -hmm. but they, 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 they invest heavily in my music because they love the music. You remember of the Stingy Men's Association? <laughs> <laughs> Simao. Simao. <laughs> <laughs> there is someone who called me earlier this week. He told me he's the chairman of the Stingy Men Association, yeah. mm. and he had wanted to come and be hosted on the show. So I was like, where did you get my number, you know? Mm -hmm. <laughs> and that's a story for another day. Yeah. But as a member or subscriber of the Stingy Men's Association, mm. do you also get played? I thought the Stingy Men's Association have the manual. Okay. okay. The reason why um, 
there was a, a group that of guides them on how there was a, a group of uh, young, young gentlemen that that came out and started the stingy men thing stingy men is basically known to hold money but it helps men budget for their money not just waste it funnily don't 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 uh, don't fail to provide for your child claiming mm. you are in small small mm. in Uganda chitegeza abasaje baita ba zimbi etama kumweke chirevu avako avako ko yeah so anyway <laughs> here's the thing um some people are hiding in small with their brokenness <laughs> with their brokenness they are just <laughs> hiding there bali mbabuli mimunze ndi wa simao but simao is basically simao basically is not uh, it's it's not about nti muntu nti nti we don't we we plan for the money yeah, yeah. men have to know when to use the money if your mother calls you that she's sick and then your girlfriend is asking for shoes that means you need to provide for your mother first mm. cuz her issue is not more than your mother's. Let me ask you a question. What's the most you've ever offered for transport for a girl? You know, let's say a girl has come, to, has come to visit. Yeah. I've been there, so I know. The amazing. Okay? Right? Your girlfriend has come to visit. Okay? In some cases, the parents are not aware. You know, they don't know where she's gone. So she has, you have to tell her, you know, okay, I'll, I'll provide some transport to and from. Right? What's the most you've what's the most you can spend and what's the most you've ever spent? Um the good thing is God has helped me that I've not dated girls who ask for transport. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um yeah, for real. I mean, I you know that's also a blessing, you know. Because me I think they uh, come with their own transport, they tell their parents that hey, I'm going to visit no, if you, my boyfriend. You need to I need show transport. interest that you're coming to see me. It's it's a two way thing. But mm. I provide for someone and I Okay, love let's you. assume, you know, uh She's shown the interest. She wants to come and visit you. In fact, that one is a stingy woman. Uh, actually, let's backtrack. <laughs> <laughs> the one who wants me to give her transport yes. is a stingy woman. I, I think you're going hard at them. <laughs> let's assume, you know, uh, some of these girls, if we, we had to, back, to go back, let's say, seven years ago, when you were a teenager, right? Teenagers date. Mm -hmm. That's for a fact, right? She's 16. You're 17, right? She wants to come and visit you, or she wants you to go out for ice cream. Back then, back then, this is not now. Mm -hmm. But then she doesn't have the, the money. Now the this is are non How are you going about that? This is what I need to tell you, that I've never dated such girls. Even when she was coming, to back then in my, my, like in my form five when I was dating, when we used to meet with the person I was dating then, she used to find ways of lying to her parents. I'm going for an overnight discussion. The parent would they give, give her money. Then she comes to me. I am, I'm not, like, I, I give out when I love someone. I give. But what we want to do is to transport. If a woman tells me you need transport, there is a girl um, some time back, uh, some time back, I think in my second year, she asked me for transport, and there and then, Nazimwa, Nevigwerao, because if you can't cater for basic things like transport, <laughs> really, no, no, I think you small, did small love things uh, uh, like transport. Warm up, guys. Munjo, did I sit here too? Transport, small, small things yeah, like yeah. that. Okay. All right, all right. I, 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 I need to, I need to speak, I need to speak to the girls, maybe Michelle. Join in, Michelle, Sharon. I'll also speak to yeah, a couple of other. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, all right. <laughs> Girls of these days, uh, the uni let's keep our masks on. Eh? Let's keep our masks on. Girls of these days, you know, I'm now past that stage of dating. Uh, university girls i used to back then before you know i became a married man but i've not really i don't know what's going on right now not so sure but i know guys are dating dating never stops even for the married right and i know there are even uh married guys who are dating university girls no. right now no those guys are the problem those guys are the problem but yes. girls of the time Char sharon or michelle how much do they give you girls for transport? Let's say, okay, let me start with this. Do you expect your boyfriend to provide transport when you go to visit him? 
Kati, I want to start with Brunaki. Savo ya gala tukolachi. Okay, he's, he's right, by the way. Yeah. Someone understanding, uh, okay, it's a two-way thing. Calvin, you have a girlfriend, and uh, you, 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 provide the, you provide money to that girl. It's not that you only have to give her money when she's coming, you get? She has to be with money. I don't know how. So who is supposed to provide? It's a two-way thing. If, if, if I don't have No, there has to be a source. Yeah. Let, 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 me, let me cut her short. Yeah. Do you know that there are women who are working to build their boyfriends? Yes. And I there understand. No this is what I need to tell. And I always tell it to you, Calvin, when mm. I come on this show. Mm. Girls out there, what do you have? Mukaba knew that men are rubbish, men drop you. But men, are, men understand when they are dating. Mm. A man who loves you will first say, what does this girl offer apart from a big bang, a smanya breasts, a makeup? But yeah. it has to come to down come down to things like do you provide like do you do you do you build me as a man? Do you help me on Zimba? No better no more kebidi ne wina even to be a bimuta gamangana ko any ne baby in tebe twita good ji choosa. Nje any man a sinak funa ku sent in emi twa wrong asa to we're gonna tell you I'm gana nyonge de ke kumi. Now that's a woman mm. who is showing you that hmm? We're having a future together. Name what I I was out, out all the time. Yeah. You don't build me. How do you expect me to care about you? That's it. These women should also learn these things. What do you bring to the table? Hmm? Yeah. For the, okay, I know many young kids out there are watching, but you know, this is PG. Mm -hmm. Now, besides sex and everything, what else do you offer? That's the question that they need to know, women. Yes, what do you offer? Ladies. Yeah? Uh, 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 pay, pay attention, pay attention. Let's listen in. Sharon, what do girls offer in these relationships? First of all, Bruno K, I'm loving your thinking and ideas. Yes, this is so good. No, this is and so good. And you see, good. girls, I want you to speak up. Don't yeah, allow so Bruno K to I'm box you up. Just because he's here, no. I'm um, Calvin. Me, me as a girl, I prefer having a boyfriend who thinks of me not because of my body, but we build each other. I personally have, have experienced that I have a boyfriend. Instead of going out, he prefers we save the money for something else. You get? Uh. <laughs> let, 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 let's let's go let's go back let's go back. I think Sharon is playing safe. Vicky, I'm not I'm, no, I'm, I'm, I'm not trying to play pass, safe pass here. The micro. Listen, let's listen to another dude. Because you see. Vicky. I'm not trying to play safe here. That's the fact. Vicky. But you know, listen, Vicky. Calvin. Vicky. One thing before you do, Fiki. Yeah. She's right. You know, let me tell you something. Yeah. And also, now, now we men don't just clap. Mm. When you go, do manly things. Listen, boys. Do manly things. Ubo ino mukazi ngakusinga sente. Yes, nga she provides. Toga na tole meri wakola your manly things. Ruana kwa mukazi amani nti gutoli na mukazi yochitegeira neno dau no jaga inzo mukazi wanga ina sente no you need to also be a man own up do some things umge na kwa mswama kete buy some things mukazi amani nti na we yochitegeira yochitegeira mukazi na kutuma you know some some of these men are funny she he knows that the girl has more money than him then she's like gendo ngoli de yoguni ne guni ne guni ne chuo zampereza sente be a man. Be a man. Do that for her. She will not but he's a man. All right. Okay. All right. Noted. Um, um Okay. If you're out there, um, because a girl will give in to a man she loves. I swear. All right. All right. Okay. All right. Let's pass the microphone to DJ Fiki. Uh, yeah, Bruno. Fiki. Bruno is right. DJ Fiki, hold it mm. a bit. <laughs> hold it a bit. I come from a generation, all right, where, yes, it's okay uh, for, a for your girlfriend to be supportive, right? Yeah. Just as you, the dude, you're supposed to be supportive. However, in many cases, the men will take the lead to support. Let me use a very simple question, you know, a very simple uh, question here. I've always, in you, know, you know, interacted with you artists. And I ask you on whether you'd be comfortable, you know, or whether you would pay 
the bill on the first date. And in many cases, you're like, what? Okay, in many cases, for the dudes, you're like, I do pay. Okay. But well, then from the Stingy Men's Association, it looks like <laughs> chances are if you ask someone out, a girl out, she's likely to be the one to pay the bill. No, let me, let me, let me um, clarify on that, Kavi. Here is the issue of a date. If it's the first date, anyaji initiating. If you as a woman initiate the date that Bruno K Nkumatida Nkufa, I want to see you. No longer Serena. Take a sentence as a Serena. I am not I am not showing interest, but you're showing interest. Now, if you're a man, you have initiated the date. Definitely you have to pay the bills. Pay them. But there are girls. I call it independent uh, schools, as by Giza Independence, like Gayaza. If you go with girls from Gayaza High, she would even want to clear the bill. Just hang out with the bill. But you need to comfortable. You need to still show you church chamber baganti. You need to still show this girl that, much as you are an independent woman, yes. you like taking on things. I'm a man. I handle these things. I handle responsibilities. Mukazu mm. mranga kaviri kajize jize muka kuswaza. Mwere is a kali kasent. What top up? Kali top up. Girls, that are not comfortable. Owe agala Brazilian ya mitwala asatu niyuku wake kumino nyabiri. Siri tata o. Yeah. Major Fiki. I also need to pick uh, Rama. Uh, today I'll need, I'll need Rama on the microphone. Uh, all right. Major Fiki. Where you come from? Yeah. Have you ever gone out on a date? I know you're a married man now. Yeah. The wife at home. Yeah. During that time when you were dating, when you were getting to know her, right? Yeah. Did you at any one point let her pay the bill? No. Now I, I paid the bill. We come from that generation, some of us. Yeah. You know, that only until you've seen that the relationship has gotten to the next level, that you would maybe in some cases meet halfway, let her, you know, you meet halfway where she pays part of the bill, yeah. you pay part of the bill, or she pays the bill. But why I would actually also support Bruno K to a certain extent is in case where it's the lady that, is that has made the move on the dude. Yeah. You know? Yeah, true. Back then, during our time, it has always been, you know, right. <laughs> the, the men would always see. <laughs> yeah. But what do you think, DJ Fiki? Ah, uh, to me, Katins won't go in now. Me, me, me. No, won't go in right now. But more. Yeah, like me, me and my wife. Uh, when we go to know each other, of course, of course, twag is a new pretty girl and you. In that, even nowadays, if I'm to do anything, she has to know. If she do, if if she has to do anything, I have to know. But you see, you well, right let, now, firstly, come on, Chimu. Like even it comes to money, zakoze zenkoze, we have to know. Okay, there is okay. that transparency. Yeah, man. Okay, you are on an, another level. But it has reached to a point where women are organizing weddings for themselves, where you find a lady, nga ten de se de mumukolo gona gona. The dude has just shown up with friends. Okay. <laughs> it comes up like I, I want the people out there home to know this, especially the ladies. Um pressure in Nakuzino. family Families are really pushing people so much. I'm going to say this. For example, this is a different generation we're living in. A generation where you find girls richer than the uh, a wife richer than the husband, oh. you get. True. You get. A generation where you find a Muslim woman dating a Christian guy. Oh. You find a muhima. Those guys who never allow people into their culture. Oh. A muhima girl choosing a Muganda boy. Oh. Generation in a, a defining the all odds. Let a generation where you find let me Prince you, William let me, let me ask marrying you a question, an ordinary yeah? woman. Let me ask you a question. Um, I stand for feminists, you know, to a certain extent. You know, girl, child, 
uh, but yes, equal, you know, uh, what a boy can do, a girl can equally do. You get. That's why we're seeing girls taking up big positions and all that. But let me ask you a question. Would you be comfortable, let's assume you're dating a, a girl that is uh, richer than you, you know, she's okay. Would you be comfortable uh, pocketing, you know, you let her foot the bill for the entire wedding, the introduction, just show up? Because uh, someone said that Abamu Abasadja, Agula Makot. It all comes Would you be comfortable this is in what such I need an to arrangement you. where you very well know, you know, that she has paid for, for those cows for families that ask for that? Would you be comfortable as a man? I wouldn't, but again, Chidda Kubak what Fiki says is okay to get um god has like listen i'm explaining calvin god has has helped me that i've dated people that understand me that they understand me even though we break up but they do understand me when it comes to issues of money and what we together o tegere mfuna ya muntu wo nti tuwe ya gala nyo neba ambi bawa angita kolachi chino tajia chisovola kati you sit down talk with your woman it doesn't take techi kujia kubu sajia kubu sajia you get you have friends calvin they can contribute some money. So, when you marry your kumukolo, then the woman takes. No, you you see, my issue has been with mm. that for a man, you like okay, I don't have, you get, but then your draw is now to show up, show face. But it's still you who is going to take the woman, <laughs> much as she has done everything. You get. Katinga ba indi, no, ba indi abasa sola dawari ngo mukazi takira konga ya fuge waka. Oshagera. It still remains to that. All right, uh, let's engage those who are watching us from home. You can uh, get involved. Our WhatsApp number is 781 We brought Let's do this right now. We're going to take three requests. Now, my boy Bruno K is in the building representing the stingy men's association is that a good introduction mm. hey <laughs> yes <laughs> but aside from is that ambassador right yes and uh there are people who actually you know uh buy into his school of thought that uh, men have been the tooth and enough is enough <laughs> it's time it's time to switch 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 up things a little bit not yes even, mm. not even the two thing only um, i mean a relationship is not an employment it's not a job you get hey. you get um <laughs> people are faking a lot of things man uh, uh, uh. for money the faking love People are faking so that, many things, man. So the, when I say... This people are faking pregnancies, faking what, faking bitchy, everything. They are faking everything. Even fake looks, fake makeup, fake everything, fake eh? hips. Man. Ah. Yo. <laughs> All right. Now, um... Uh, okay, let's keep it clean, eh? Let, let's not go PG. I know some people are getting a, li a little Emotion. excited, eh? Love, it's a gray area, eh? So we say what we can say at this time, right? I see Collins has already taken position, but it's all good. I'm going to be engaging again. True. Your relationship with the media personality, Farida Nakaziwe. You did a song, Farida. It's a very beautiful song. I think she loves it. Uh, earlier on, we are talking about stars and how protective they are with their partners. One example we shared was that of Jay-Z and Beyonce. Whereby for Jay-Z, if it's a video shoot, he hires a team of people that ensures that you don't, that ensures that you don't take uh, your artistry way beyond where it's supposed to stop. Right? Even from performances, you're informed where to touch and where not to touch, what to sing about, what, what not to sing about. You sang a whole song for Farida Nakazibwe. You know, I don't know how her partner feels about the song, but I know the lady must be loving this song. Well, Lately, you've been posting a lot about her. And uh, I think, you, you know, she must be happy. <laughs> Of course. <laughs> of course. Okay, anyway, let me tell I you. I mean, you know, compliments. Mm. It, do you know how beautiful it feels when there is someone that is complimenting you yeah. every now and then? 
you know, you're young, handsome, uh, many girls would want to take up that space. They, 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 I think, I'm sure there are girls out there who are like, I wish I were the one being posted and by yes. Bruno K. And here you are posting another person. Do you love her? Auntie Chizu, which are, which are the, their wishing is they're they not mentors. Like they're not inspirational to other people, you know. I would feel good uh, posting a woman that has yeah, Let's bring the microphone closer. I would feel good posting somebody who, 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 has, who has changed the society, inspiring other people you get. So this is a song I did, you know. In this music industry, you need to yeah, have. How, how come you're not posting uh, the Speak of Parliament? Uh -huh. How come you're not posting uh, <laughs> your, your, your <laughs> Flavi? Eh? Full <laughs> figure. <laughs> hey, it's because. No, Mumuga Seko. Okay, Vuga Fire Bruno. Okay. All right. Okay. This is what happens. This yeah. is we in the music industry. It's a showbiz business first and foremost. Second, it's about art. Art is about creating. Mm. Um, you, you you know last time when I was here, I mean, they read about me a story that me and how we were dating, and it was never true. Mm. So what what happened out of when we met on her on her show, mm. we became friends, and up to now we're good friends. But you would date, right? They say age is just a number. Yeah. Yeah. We would date you, you. We would date in the media eye, because that's what media wants us to do. No, <laughs> let's go past media. If it were if it wasn't for the camera, let's think you would still would date her. Calvin, you're so funny. No, you know what I'm saying, Zach? <laughs> she's beautiful. Yeah. You know, she's got it. <laughs> oh, anyway. Uh, but back, you did. Back to the other point. I was still finishing. <laughs> back to the other point. I'm still finishing as I'm concluding to your, to your side. Yes. This is what happened. I created the song, which worked. Because that's what. Abantu wanku wake mbozi. Omutu wajana kuhito omu bingo limu yimbi. Yimba and indi mubi. They don't have time. But guy like I'm too far just when you call me something, I'll tell you, okay, fine. You've called me something. So these guys came. I've had a couple of issues with social media bullies, but now they no longer bully me because they know Bruno K is a hard guy. You bully the bullies. You come to me on my page, I'll give you straight one to one to swap. You get, mm. you get, because every time you accept society to to always disrespect you, write wrong things about you. I mean, that's how they treat you. So, mm. what I did is I embraced this thing. You know, movie. movie. And it worked. Yeah. And we became friends from then. Mm. Opposite sex. Bruno very close to a certain lady. Bruno But we have friends in this industry. We make friends. You get. Yeah, yeah. Yes. But she's beautiful. We need to talk after this show. We need to talk off camera, right? <laughs> so, Valentine's Day is happening tomorrow. Mm. Uh, 14th uh, Feb, right? What does this day mean to you? Have you ever celebrated Valentine's Day? Uh, what do the stingy men, okay, the, what do the members of the Stingy Men's Association say about Valentine's Day? Uh, tomorrow, Stingy Men have a, a conference. Yeah. We have a men's conference. We are not available tomorrow. We are going to be busy discussing national issues of economic development. <laughs> <laughs> so, so, so we, we, we have uh, two, uh, main speakers, Gaetano. We have Gaetano. We have uh, Patrick Kanyomozi. He's mm. married, but he's a member of Stingy Men. So he's going to be there as a main speaker. But Valentine's Day, I've celebrated it once, and it was a disappointment. What happened on your first experience? I proposed on Valentine's Day. Oh, yeah. I remember you actually also got a, a tattoo <laughs> of your girlfriend. <laughs> right? <laughs> I remember. About three or four years. No, people mistake okay, that what? tattoo. Let's clarify. Yes. Let me clarify on mm. that tattoo issue. This is what happens. Me and my ex were expecting a child, and we, we planned of names, talked about it. With she was pregnant? Uh, yes. And then we said, uh, because our, our child was a girl, it was supposed to be a girl. So I told, you know, when we have a girl, you, um, we, we're going to name her your name. She's called, uh, I don't want to mention her because she's in a relationship now. Yeah. So when we agreed, I told her, because we're going to name our daughter that name, mm. 
I am going to take a tattoo for our daughter because I was excited to be a father at the first time. Yeah, yeah. First time father. Yeah. So I went and took a tattoo of my daughter's name that I was expecting. My daughter had the same name as her mother. So everyone who used to see the tattoo on my hand used to say, that's the mother. That's the the, mother. The, the, because they didn't know that she was pregnant. And she had a miscarriage towards the, the you know, the, the, towards when she was about to maybe, exp like when the months were you almost know, whatever, she, she okay. got a miscarriage. Mm, mm, mm. But me, I already had my tattoo. That's the only thing I will remember from that. Because oh. we were expecting a child and we were madly in love. Mm. So but always people mistake it. Saying, let me hope okay, it's not a lie tattoo. because I've seen... It's not. It's I've not. seen, you know, guys, you know, in relationships, boy, girl, mm -hmm. okay? But they have tattoos, you know, of their partners. Ladies, do you have do you have some tattoos of your loved ones? Atemuja kukiriza. Fiki, tattoo, hajat. Yeah, 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 yeah. So what happens when you fall when you've fallen out with that person? Do you remix the tattoo? Is it removed? Mine, I remained with it because I told you, I took it for the child that I was expecting with the person I was dating. So it's there and I it will always remain there. I don't care what other people think. They say a lot of things, but only me and the person I was dating then oh. know the real story behind the tattoo. <laughs> yes, now back to Valentine's. I celebrated mm. it once, it was a disappointment, but it does not stop you from celebrating Valentine's. Mm. If you are with the right person, yeah. a person that deserves to be celebrated. <laughs> No, you say no more. I go not to move. I go. Valentine has to be every day. Is Valentine's? Treat your woman. Treat your man special. Don't in a Valentine you can only go go away into the way. But I got a gun. I'm not going to move for for for. Choka wa ni na kuenda la toya gara kumutu alamu obobu. Like what's the use of that? So, but if you're in love with, if you're not in love with the right person, don't celebrate Valentine's. They save your money. Go see your mother. Like me right now, I'm going to see my mother. You're going to see your because mother because I don't have a Valentine's yeah, date. Yeah. Have you ever been in a, a situation where you're dating three girls, it's Valentine's Day, they all need your attention, and how did you go about it? Uh, Calvin, playing is very uh, expensive. It's a full-time Expensive. Job. I, I have tried to play sometime, but you know, it's not worth it. Because at the end of the day, why are you playing, why are you playing with people's feet? But people joke with love. Love mm. is okuta. Me, I almost died, Calvin. <laughs> Fick is my friend, he knows. Mm, mm. When I was going through depression, I lost my weight. I, I, I was almost losing it. People so tell you they are, some girls tell you they are in those relationships. One is paying, okay, they pay different bills. One pays rent, uh huh. Uh huh, another on tuition. You know, Kati, this one. is the problem. Now, ladies out there, I think um, the person on the camera, focus it on me so that I tell these ladies out there. Mm. Ladies out there. Stop these funny things. Work, come on. Work. Otherwise, mungi na mu relationships baba kube because you 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 in a relationship muga ya sasula rent. You're dating someone else's husband, and you're comfortable mbunzi nzete bingu kuata koko kasta is providing. Like really, a person who who went to church or a mosque, church or mosque with someone and they made vows in front of God, and you're there dating that same person. And you think you'll be successful in that relationship? You understand? Mm, mm. Stop compromising yourselves. Work for yourselves. Mm, and mm. women right now have opportunities. Work. These women who work can tell you. Not so. Any more could you? Any more could you? Because he will speak to you in a disrespectful way. No one will watch me in the mukazo no yeso. But any time she can go, she can stand on her own. He will never disrespect you. All right. Now, um, you can engage us. Seven eight one forty five eighty five. Zero three. We have, a, you know, we've had a number of issues that we've, you know, been dissecting here, from relationships to Bruno K and a couple of other guys who believe that uh, yes, this business of giving girlfriends transport money, you said it's a no-no go zone. A girl well, should be uh, able to pay every, for her transport. Every man has their own principles. Me as Bruno K, yeah. I still think. I can cater for other things. I can buy you dresses. I can I can help you with tuition, help you out with a business proposal you have. Yeah. Some money. 
na yo mtu obutonunga transport mm. echo si sola chikola because come on if you woman and you can't prove tosola kwete kama sente kujja kunda banze go gamba go yagala taina and no unless the only time i pay for transport unless omukazi muise nti omanyi darling come and see me bichi bichi and i know that bambi omukazi ono tali stingi simu ko double ka sera ze tatika mu michel on the first date you want me to give you transport what is the most you've ever received as transport money the the most i think 200 Two hundred k. Okay, it's like this. It's like this. Let me explain. He has asked. Let me explain. Let me explain. You guys. No, let me explain. Let me explain. Musoga. Wamani ro kugaba alukumi. Let me explain, Calvin. As I've told you, a man will not only give you money when you're going to visit him. So a man will send you money. Okay, I, I take it as transport. Ogolimba now. I don't think it's over transport. Calvin, I'm explaining to you. It's not that a man will only give. Okay, going. Oh, okay, what is the most? Two hundred. All right. Okay, let's pass the microphone. Swag Lord. Swag Lord. No, no, pass the microphone. Swag Lord. Swag Lord. What's the most you've ever given? Transport money. To your girlfriend. Huh? Ah, that is another well, one think, from the stingy. I think uh, I, I'm a type of like Bruno K. Yeah. Also, I don't go around with goers for transport. Hey. Yeah. So if somebody okay. wants to see me, I'm. There is, there is a dentist here. Robbie, the church boy. Yes, sir. How? Oh, what's the most you've ever given? Okay, let if I have, I can just give her because I feel like I should. What was the most? Uh, 50. 50K? Yeah. Oh, right okay, the lady next to you. To All right, la lady next to you. What's the most you've ever received or given? What's, what's the most you've ever given? 50? Hey, hey, you people are giving out a lot of money. All right, Collins. <laughs> Yes. What's the most? Um, I think I've only given once, and that was twenty thousand. Twenty thousand. Yeah, and that was like when she was going back. You know, she just uh, come to visit. Uh, she she transported herself. Okay. Bruno has but on the other issue, mm. I'm, I'm going to defend her. Um, you know that everybody, all of us, some men give 10, mm. there are men who even give transport of 1M. Mm. For example, you a young girl. You, you know, especially those butchers girls. Babo nyabo nyabo and no, no, no. Those married men, you are transporting over Gaba million. You move, check it out. Choka mukazi wa diwaka babo nyabo nyabo. So I'm not saying that you know these women receive that money, a lot of it. Nzewaro chali wangi yadi asabu muare namba na muwe mituala atano. Niinga na kamu gama ngudi da yolanchi yebi. So what could you say? What 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 brings about that? It is confusion. Omani fa basadja abamu. Kasara ba kukabina, even to every two, people confusing abamwe. Some men get attracted by physical looks of women. Yeah, yeah. yeah. All right, so, but you, one thing we've all, we, you know, we've all agreed at two is as men, we should be ready, we should be able to support our partners. Yeah. Right? True. It might not necessarily be transport money, like you shared, but in other areas. But it is not a must. I will support my wife mm. or my fiance or my girlfriend when I feel I need to support her. You get? Because mm. but relationships are for the job opportunities. A relationship is not a job opportunity. What has brought about that? This is I've told you a woman who works. Oh, it is the other way that no. the men now. No, let me tell you this. Mm. A woman, I mean, 
guys that have dated girls who work, so if you think his wife works and you know all these guys can testify, mm. there is a way women who work for themselves. Gabay nani independent man? Wabu wa bakora nunga kora ni millioni zisoba baabiri ni inga taina independent man. But don't you think that some men are now have now taken advantage of that? Yes, that women are providing for them or girlfriends are providing that they have taken the back seat and they want to always be on the receiving end. Antia wa mkugambi de. You so women should know these things. Omusajja akwa gara. Yutoja na kueta aga musi indika kuwa. Ni waba muavu nga musi inga sent. Yeah. I have dated girls that are richer than me that earn more money than I do but I still, because I loved them, I still did things for What's them. What's the most you've ever received from a girl who uh, likes you? I no better, you know. I think even more than 10 m. 10 m. Yes, she would just, you know, she would, you know, she would just see you going. Nacho bana bana nacho. Nachimala. 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 How did that? Out of love, turn negula ako. Okay. Did you you loved her? Yeah, of course. How did that movie end? Kwe. <laughs> 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 Yeah, go ahead, yeah, you. Film star, yeah, film Mugundi. Okay. Yeah? All right, let me read a few comments here. Then I'll engage you, MC Sugar, and the rest. Hello, Calvin. Thank you for the show. Uh, I'm a whiz. I'm following the show. Very exciting. Uh, watching from Namungona. Calvin, it's not a bad idea to give transport to someone you are in love with. But according to me, it will depend on her status of earning when I know she's doing something which earns her money, I cannot give her money for transport. That's what he thinks. There's another one here. Hey, guys, man, thank you for the show. Eric from Makerere University. Me, I concur with the Bruno K on the issue of transport. We don't have to give girls transport because she's coming to check on me. She also has to contribute. True. Okay. Another one. Wabula Bruno K is right today. Ladies need to step up in the in the game. This era, you got to, you, you you have to make your own money, uh, and I men shouldn't think it is it's a must for us to burden uh, to burden them. Nevertheless, women are meant to be pampered. This is Harry. You're saying never date, never date a woman who asks for transport, whether what or what. And I'll read the second last one. All right, Davis, you're saying. Calvin, I wonder what ki what kind of men we are raising of late. Men who are not willing to support their girlfriends. Where do you expect that girl to get the money? <laughs> okay, now let me answer him before actually we go back to that. Let me answer him. We are left. Uh, okay, yes, bro. Okay, just I'll, I'll read two. I'll read two more. Uh, WhatsApp is on fire. You can equally participate. You know, tomorrow is Valentine's Day. That's why we are having this yeah. topic. Yeah. Somebody is saying, as a lady, you are supposed to ask for transport or cash to visit your brother. People ask for money. Ah, are prostitutes. Yeah. Ah, <laughs> there I disagree. You know. Okay, somebody is saying the two hundred k transport is possible if there is. Okay. Wow. <laughs> I will not read that. You know. But another here. Thank you. Okay. Thanks for the show, Calvin. This is Ken from Chambogo. For the case of wedding, it's never realistic for a man to feel confident when a woman does everything for the wedding. It takes away your respect as a man. Then for transport, it's never fair for a loving girlfriend to ask for transport and always need to provide time to your girlfriend when you have Ah, uh, I really like Bruno K's submission. Let's let me read two from girls mm -hmm. now. It's girl, you know, you can't wait. Is that but now, you are you, what you are, guy, a cheba and nonsense. He is so close to taxi guys, so he gives them taxi guys 1k. Hey, when I not taxi ever dropping, a cheba, you have a soul. <laughs> yes, we are about to wrap up the show. We are left with exactly 10 minutes, you know, to go to get off UBS and Magic One. MC Sugar, okay, one okay. minute. But let me just wrap up yes. shortly. 
Uh, I'm going to contradict a little bit with Bruno K over the issue of uh, transport and all that. Why do I say so? Uh, it starts from how you propagate this relationship. Mm. Once you engage no government, I, I love you and she loves you back, you have to put it in her head that the two of you have insecurities, you have things that you can and things that you cannot. And that is one thing that very many men don't do. Painting a picture that is false. He wants the, the girl to perceive the fact that a uh, Mugaga, Ainao, Erasovola, can handle everything. And at the end of the day, the girl takes that in. And so what happens is she begins to become so so demanding. But if you straight away, uh, not caring whether you're being transparent that you see, I am Ndimuzimbi, Mfuna Yomu Tuaru, Rirunaku, Atenangi Mbanzi, Etagako. So you should not expect me to give you money beyond this kind of budget. That will be better. But guys keep hiding again. Then afterwards, he dresses up so smart and comes for, for a date. So what happens at the end of the day is this girl is having a wrong picture. And definitely you'll end up a victim. So as a person, I expect money from sugar. No, that's not out. So I give them straight up and if I'm to go to see, uh, to see sugar, and you know, take a moon and then love it, and you take a moon and say you because.